So <laughs> today is was the day that Ernie proposed to Nicole, July 22nd, on, I don't know, around what time, probably like 10 maybe. Okay, Uncle Peter, tomorrow, July 22nd, your little girl, Nicole, is going to be engaged, hopefully. What do you want to tell her? That's a very good question. Thank you for asking, Bethany, my niece, whose birthday is also tomorrow. Well, I knew this day would come, and so I prayed, I anticipated, I'm prepared emotionally, psychologically, and spiritually. So it's uh, going to be very uh, sentimental to me because she's my only daughter. And But I'm very excited for her and for Isaias. And uh, I hope and pray only the best for them uh, throughout their life. And uh, in the knowing that there's going to be ups and downs, but they need to communicate and work things out always. Um, I'm excited for tomorrow, one day at a time, one step at a time. So tomorrow's a big day, and I'm looking forward to it. We're going to go to the mountaintop and, uh, and be able to see that very special moment for her and for him. So I pray that everything go well and that it's everything that uh, they both uh, uh, expected how it would be. So that way they would have long lasting memories of that special moment. Yes, yeah, so I'm excited and uh, we'll see how I, how I am able to compose my, myself up there. <laughs> but yeah, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be good, it's gonna be exciting. So I'm, I'm looking forward to it. Hi Nicole Marie, my baby girl. I am so excited for you, mija. You have waited um, for this day, and I just thank the Lord that you found the one. I have asked you over and over throughout uh, these past few years if it's a yes, is the one, and you always say yes. I am so happy that you are in love, and I am so happy for um, the future of all the planning we're going to be able to do together. I am sad, but I'm also very grateful for the Lord that you found a good um future husband and I am so um, excited for you and I hope that um, tomorrow is everything that you hope for uh, the planning that Isaiah yeah, has done for you and um, it has been a secret since December and it's been very hard for us not to share this um, the emotions the excitement um, for the past six months with you but we have hopefully a few months a year to uh, plan the best wedding that you have dreamed of and uh, just I thank the Lord again that um, that you did find the one and I'm happy for both of you I'm happy for our future to blend both families together and um, just keep going strong and putting God first in your relationship and um, again just put him first Miha do your do your best, and God will do the rest for both of you. And um, I, I'm going to miss you, but I, I, I'm very happy for you. Love you. God bless you, my little girl, my little princess. I love you so much, and I'm just so happy for you. Love you, baby. God bless you. Well, quiero decirles que estamos igual de contentos, felices por esta decisión que van a tomar o que ya tomaron pero que hoy es un día especial es una felicidad de ser parte de esta reunión que sin lugar a duda marcará sus vidas y esperando que Dios les conceda muchísimos muchísimos años de matrimonio y nunca van a olvidar este día gracias por permitirnos ser parte de esta hermosa sorpresa Y esperamos que Dios bendiga sus vidas y ya saben, no matter what, babies come right away. I can have time to wait. Dios los bendiga. I love you guys. Que estoy muy contenta, muy feliz por ellos, porque están tomando un paso que yo sé que Dios está con ellos. 
porque lo están agradando a él y estoy muy feliz por, por todas estas decisiones, por todo esto que están, que están haciendo paso a paso y que les deseo que Dios los bendiga, que siempre, siempre tengan a Dios en el centro de su, de su matrimonio, que siempre con Dios todo es posible y, y yo sé que Él está con ustedes porque lo están agradando. Felicidades y adelante a los siguientes pasos. Que mi Dios me los bendiga mucho a los dos. Les deseo todo lo mejor. Felicidades. I'm feeling very excited. I'm super happy. Uh, I think my emotions are starting to feel to kick in right now. Um, super excited though. I um, can't wait for uh, this new chapter, this new season. Um, I know that Nicole has been waiting a long time and she found the one and I know Sias has also found the one. So I'm excited to have a new brother uh, to welcome him to the family, but I'm also excited because uh, they're going to start their own family. Um, and I just can't wait to be a part of that in any way I can. I hope uh, that you enjoy this day. I hope you like the setup. And yeah, I love you guys. Hello, Sayas, Nicole. Well, we're very happy to be here today and celebrating this moment with both of you. Uh, we just want you to know that we love you very much, and it's an honor that we get to be here together all celebrating this special moment for you guys. Sayas, Nicole, welcome to your proposal. Um, we hope it was a surprise for you guys. Um, this means that we totally love you guys because we woke up super early and yes, yes. did something we've never done, Definitely. hiking. <laughs> but... Um, Nicole, it's a process that's going to start. It's a journey of like a lot of um, what could be stressful moments. My advice is enjoy every moment of it. Make it all about the two of you, what you guys love. And um, Sayas, I still remember when um, you told me you had met a girl. And before you even continued on to like ask her to be your girlfriend, you were like, she's the one. And I've always known that you've been determined. And um, I know that you're going to be very happy in this process. And I know that it's a new chapter. And I'm so grateful that you found someone who makes you smile like crazy. And who you, just to hear, see her phone call come in, you, your face shines up. And I'm so glad that you found someone who loves you, who respects you, and... Um, we're just so happy. Nicole, we raised him right. <laughs> Take care of him. But um, it's a process that we just, our advice to you guys is to enjoy every moment of it with your loved ones and um, just take in everything and make it a memorable time. We love you guys and we're so grateful that you guys allowed us to be part of it. We love you. Sias and Nicole, we wish you the best in this new chapter of your lives and uh, may the Lord pour his blessings upon you both and be happy enjoy it every single moment every single second and we're here right behind you guys god bless you i am very happy for both of you it's very emotional everyone's here and i'm glad i am so excited to see your reaction i'm so excited to see the emotion of everybody and um you know i'm praying for the best marriage and the best life for the both of you you guys are going to be great and yeah i'm gonna miss you sias Nicole, you're going to take care of him. I believe in you. I'm so excited. Can't wait to have another sister. Um, oh. <laughs> not me tearing up. I told myself not to cry. I'm just happy you really make my brother happy. And the way you give him a smile, that never goes away. I can't wait for you to be a part of the family, Nicole. I love you. I love you, Sayas. And I can't wait. Hi, Nicole. Hi, Miha. Um, I'm very excited for you and for, for Ernie. Um, I just thank the Lord that he's giving you this opportunity and that you've been doing God's will. You've been honoring the Lord and your parents. And for this, the Lord's going to bless you. He's going to bless your life, mija. I love you very much. 
you have always, I have always been a part of your life and you've been a part of our life. So I see you like a daughter. I'm so excited for you and I just wish that, I know that the Lord's gonna bless you in a mighty way because you have had good examples in your life, your parents. And you have honored your parents and you have respected your parents. And because of this, the Lord's going to give you a long life with many blessings. I love you very much. And many, many blessings to you, Mijo. And I will always be here for you. Always. God bless you. How do you feel about your niece getting proposed to tomorrow? Mm, I feel good. I'm happy for her. I'm happy for Nicole Poligoli. Don't call her Nicole Poligoli. She doesn't like to be called Nicole Poligoli. I'm not going to call you Nicole Poligoli no more because you're going to be engaged. So anyways, I'm happy, excited, and uh, I just wish a lot of blessings from the Lord to you and to Ernie. God bless you. Nicole. Dang, I don't notice it was her crying. Um. Uh, okay, I'm going to start off with the story. The first time I met Ernie, which was me and Nicole came to Vegas for something. I don't remember what. It was a service. Then we went to Korean barbecue and you sat me down and you were like, Bethany, there's this guy who likes me. But I don't know if I like him yet. And little did I know that tomorrow he's the same guy that will be proposing to you. <laughs> oh, that's so crazy. Um, I'm just so happy for you. And I feel like I've been, I've been there through it all. Um, being your chaperone and. Just when you would talk about him, I can't stop crying. I'm sorry, but I'm just so happy for you. I love you. You're my sister, and my sister is getting engaged tomorrow, and it's just exciting, but very um, emotional. And I can't wait for weddings, um, the vlogs that are going to be coming out of this, um, planning the wedding. Um talking about your future home with Ernie and hopefully that's in um California not Vegas but even if it is in Vegas I can't wait to come visit and hang out and you take me to all the places that you um find and stuff but I love you and I can't wait for you to watch this video <laughs> and um yeah I love you and I'm so excited and Ernie I know you're gonna treat her well because if you don't I'll beat you up um, but I'm just so excited. You're going to be, a, you're my brother now after, to, well, after you get married, but starting tomorrow, you're in the process of becoming one of my brothers, and I'm just so excited, and I love you both. Bye. What do you want to tell her and Ernie? Mm. I feel happy. I'm kind of, like, sad because I didn't eat breakfast, and we woke up at 5 in the morning, 4 in the morning. But I'm happy that I made the trip out here to see Nicole and Sias. And then hopefully they move to India so I can hang out with Sias more. But I'm happy for them. And I can't wait for them to get married. And then, yeah, I'm happy for you guys. I am so excited. You guys are getting engaged today. We're trying to keep it a secret. So we've been trying to throw Nicole off and just be like oh we're just gonna take pictures and vlog but we're super excited for you guys I can't wait I can't wait to just see her reaction to everything because I know it's like her dream proposal so we're super excited for you guys first off congratulations also second off um I don't know I just want to say that I am so happy for the both of you. Uh, it hasn't been too long that I've been around, but thank you for letting me be a part of this special day. Um, everyone here loves you, and we'll see you guys in about like an hour. I'm here, and I'm excited for you guys to get here. We set up everything Nicole style. That's all that matters. Yes. 
because we know you're going to love it. And I, we hope you love the bouquet. I know it's not wildflowers, but we love you. And you're in the wild, and they're flowers. That's all you're going to get. <laughs> Be thankful you're getting married now. I love you, Nicole. And I know we used to talk about this all the time when you would come over and sleep over. And then I used to wake you up in the middle of the night, and I used to be like, "Much next time when you come, you're going to be married. And you'd be like, no, I'm not. I didn't even ask my dad. But I love you. And I'm so proud of you and Sias for coming this far after so long and after the year. And I love you so much. And I'm so grateful for our friendship. And I'm grateful for you, Sias, as well, for always taking care of me and being my older brother. <laughs> I love you guys. I'm super happy for you guys, honestly, like, I don't think like uh, words can describe like the happiness that I have for both of you guys, the love that I have for both of you guys. Uh, it truly means a lot to me to know that um, you guys found each other and make each other happy. And I don't want to get emotional because I feel like I, I am already, but I'm happy and I, I'm ha I'm grateful that I get to be here and experience this. You know, it's been a long time coming, and I can't wait to see what God has in store for you both. So I was stressed because, like, in the in the in the morning, because everyone was like, by everyone I mean my parents were like leaving the house super late, and then <laughs> me and Joel got picked the, the girls up super late, like an hour late. So I was a little like stressed, but I was like, you know what, we're about to get there, enjoy this time, enjoy this moment, because you know, one moment, one chance, this opportunity goes once in a lifetime. So I I better lose myself. Um, so when I was fine, and then when I saw the tree stump, that's like our land, uh, what's it called? Uh, like a landmark? Landmark. Yeah. Um, of, we're here, and it was a lot sooner than I anticipated. And I was like, oh. And then I was like, oh, I got, I got feet. <laughs> <laughs> so then I came, and then my heart was just dropping and racing. And I texted Victoria. I was like, I was like, um, setting up, but now my heart's racing. And she was like, deep breath, you got this. Aww. And I was like, all right, yeah, yeah, you're right. And so I mic'd up, and I think the moment I, I was like, come here. I was like, come here. <laughs> um, and then walking her up was, yeah, and I wrote stuff down. I'll keep that a little private between me and Nicole. But I just, it, everything just went away, and all I saw was her. <laughs> when did you know that this was happening? Okay. I didn't know it was happening today. I mean, yeah. So when we got here, I was like, I didn't, was like, didn't think it was going to happen like at all in this moment, like this hike. I was like, maybe on the way down. I don't know. But then we started um, walking. And um, I think what kind of gave it a little bit away was like Joel was like vlogging. And so I was like, oh, he never does that. But I was like, oh, maybe he just has it because like Leslie has all these cameras. Um, but it wasn't until he came back after he said he had to use the restroom he was like come here and I was like okay and we started walking and then I noticed the mic but I didn't think too much of it until we started walking further this way and then I saw the like the setup when I saw the setup that's when like I knew obviously it was happening and then I was like oh okay like no one else is here and it was just the four of us and I was like oh that's kind of sweet like it probably is just gonna be us and then he got on one knee and like I was already in tears crying like I couldn't I couldn't imagine what was going on and then I turned because I wanted to like see Leslie like her and then Abner was there and I was like everyone's here and I didn't see anyone else until afterwards but I was really surprised and I'm really happy how everything turned out it was better than I can imagine you did a great job thanks babe. <laughs> shout out to Victoria for helping us out yeah yeah okay